Can we talk about how God puts you in places alone for reasons? Um, my personal opinion is that he puts you in places alone for you to get to know self, love self. Sometimes life isn't just always about a party, you know? Life is really about loving self, understanding self, building, teaching self, so that you can teach this to others. I mean, I feel like the purpose in life is for you to share, you know? You can't be stingy with game that you know you really didn't create. You just started doing it after you saw someone else doing it. I mean, like, let's be real. Like I said in the first broadcast, everything repeats itself. Sometimes it takes for you to be different and not repeat it. You know, it's just like a song that you press up on replay and it just repeats, it repeats, it repeats, it repeats. We have to learn how to break these cycles. Um, I know really from my past experiences, I watch families or let's say my family go through the rings, you know, all because of shit. That didn't have nothing to do with them. Nothing. You're mad because your mom mad. And then they mad because they mom mad. But y'all two blood cousins. And this ain't y'all problem. Y'all is actually the kids. But no. Like I said, the cycle just repeats. And it's for you to break that motherfucker. And choose to be different. And stop holding on all these goddamn bags and shit like the bag lady, Erica Badu, said. You're going to miss your bus, period. Why? Because you're dragging too much fucking stuff. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. But that's just my personal opinion. You know? Share. Sharing is worth more money Than anything, my personal opinion. Why? Because if you share, God blesses you. Not to mention, you're planting a seed in a soil. The soil is so rich. They're innocent. They're young-minded to where it can grow. It can bloom. It can plant other seeds and it'll grow, especially considering in the black community, you know, or let's say the urban community. Because I fuck with Asians. I grew up with Asians, Chinese, Filipinos, Cambodian, whatever the fuck, all that shit. Mexicans, Puerto Rican, Spanish, Cuban. I'm from the dubs. Excuse me. But yes, we are urban as fuck over there. Okay. And we all grew up together. So with that being said, we have to learn to stop holding on to bullshit that we can't control. You get it? All it does is bring hatred to self, meaning you're thinking about certain things that you really can't even fix. And it's just manifesting up in your head. It becomes jealousy. Straight the fuck up. You cannot sit around and pay attention to others. You just can't. I never did. Me personally. I salute. I'm never the one that sits around and talk about you behind your back, doing weird shit behind your back. I'm not her. Never have been. I've always had it done to me, though. Always. That's why I have a limited, a limited of people that I even associate myself to. Yeah, I have become unaccessible. Why? Because it's too many damn, de- too many damn de- demons and devils and shit. And I don't know who is who I used to be great at. Well, at least I thought I was great at this got me undisguising the the the, the people in the the sheep clothing. I thought I was very, very good at it. But in reality, I wasn't a pro. Still isn't a pro. But I know to just separate. Meaning give people space. Make them realize 
who you are. I mean, in so many words, not trying to be cocky or nothing, but be humble in the most humblest way. You are God's child. I am God's child. And if you think about it, people that I've ever associated with, I've been nothing but good to them. Nothing but good to them. Always show love, but you'll never hear them say it. Never hear them say it. A motherfucker will forget everything and remember something so, so stupid. But we'll forgive a man or vice versa for a man and a woman. However, just my opinion. Mm, Like I said, I'm new to this damn podcasting shit, so... Let me know what y'all think about my new podcast. Is you feeling it or no? We can speak more up on this subject shortly. Um, Like I said, I'm new to this podcast and shit. I'm new to YouTubing. These are things that I have been wanting to do for years. But has been so fucked up mentally and distracted by myself. Nobody else. I distract myself. I'm not a follower. I've always been a leader. So anything that I've done in life, as far as my distractions go, it's because I let it. I knew what the fuck I was doing. I knew I was probably dancing with a devil or playing with fire, shall we say. But hey, I'm new to this shit, y'all. Y'all fucking with me or no. I really don't give a fuck if you is or not, really. Because I fuck with myself. Tough. Deuces. And my mama words. Imagine that. <laughs>